Hey guys, Pedguin here, and today we are taking a look at the Terraria 1.2 preview that Redigit has just posted on the Demilogic channel on YouTube. Okay, so the full link is down in the description if you want to watch it without any commentary, but we're just going to be going through what, pretty much what the video consists of. So yeah, let's take a look, shall we? But before we start the video, however, let's just take a look at the map in the top right, which you've probably noticed straight away. You may or may not recognize this, but a long time ago there was a mod where you could view the Terraria world. And it looks like he's implemented something similar to that, because that looks quite similar. And it pretty much just prints off your world, but now you can actually see your character's head. And you'll probably be able to see your other friends um, if you're playing multiplayer as well. And there's actually a plus and a uh, minus sign, which you'll be able to zoom into the map and go further away, just in case your, your friends are at different distances. And I'm assuming the equal sign kind of minimizes it, just in case, depending on your the screen size, um, you probably want it either minimized or not there at all because you know, it's not always necessary sometimes you're in a rush and you don't want it in the way fighting a boss you don't really need a map so yeah that's what nice feature that's just been added okay we're going to play the video now talking about what we see as we go through and I'm going to be pausing at sections just to have my input uh, now and again so let's get started shall we okay so apart from the music you've probably noticed the new types of trees straight away um, I'm not sure if these are completely redesigned of the old trees or they're a different type. We'll find out shortly. Um, but the, you may have noticed that he's also running on a bunch of half blocks either. There's no more jumping around across the landscape. Let's just pause it here. Okay, so there's a lot to look at right here. As you can see, he's just uh, mined away that one block and it's created a little tiny waterfall. So that's a new uh, feature of water effects. You may have noticed as well that the water at the top is and actually depleting it's actually staying there so it's a lot like the minecraft system where if you get a bucket of water and put it in a certain area it will constantly flow a source of water which entirely adds a whole new level of creation within the game which i really really like so that's amazing feature that they've added right there okay so continuing the video so you'll notice him create some diagonal blocks that like we saw on the roof earlier when we ran over it and we can also create some uh, half blocks as you see the water flow of the edges. Those are the same types of blocks that he was running over earlier as well. So you can create them yourselves. Another feature is the uh, the paint tool. Um, this is a really interesting feature. Uh, another massive aspect to uh, the creativity of just building anything you want. And then you can just colour it anything. Any colours. There's so many colours that you can actually colour it. There's not just purple. There's many wide variety of different colours. I think there's 60 different colours in total and maybe more in the future. So there's a lot of different colours that you can choose from. You can also uh, colour your armour different colours as well um, which has just been quoted by Redigit on Twitter. Okay, as you can see, there's a new block. I'm assuming it's called something along the lines of the rainbow block or something, as it's constantly changing colours. And if you actually add water to it, it actually enhances the water's colours. I have to assume that if that other water wasn't there, it'd actually make the whole water rainbow. Um, there's also these fountains that you may have noticed. They look like statues, but they're actually fountains. And they actually enhance the colour of water in that vicinity as well, which is a really interesting feature. And as usual, we have to go out with a bang. And he's just showing off some of the new weapons that are actually coming out in 1.2 update. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little preview of the 1.2. The full video without commentary is down in the description. So you might want to check that out. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys later.